guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much to all my lovely and wonderful subscribers and if you are new to my channel please do not forget to subscribe if you love food African food yummy Nigerian food then this is a place to be and if you also love to enjoy your food with pride then this is also the place to be because we cook and also we demolish like champions in here <laughs> so anyway guys today's recipe is a goosey pepper soup yes this is a good way to still enjoy your egusi if you are somebody who is uh, dieting and you do not want red oil in your meal egusi pepper soup is a very very delicious soup that you can also make and while on your weight loss journey you can also be enjoying a good african nigerian food and then if you're also on weight loss journey you can swap the meat that i'm going to be using for fish or something more healthier anyway guys we are going to be making a goosey pepper soup today i'll be taking you guys over there and i'll be introducing you guys to our ingredients for today welcome to my kitchen our ingredients for today I am going to be using dry fish I'm going to be using crayfish I'm going to be using onions Maggi and ehu seed I'm going to be using egusi I'm going to be using salt I am going to be using baby spinach I'm going to be using scent leaf and habanera pepper so guys this is our meat so in the pot I have beef and I have cow skin so I have beef and I have cow skin so I'm going to add my ingredients and we will start uh, cooking our meat so I'm going to add my onions I'm going to add salt I'm going to add two maggi and I will cover and we'll start cooking our meat until the meat is uh, soft so guys while our meat has started uh, cooking I'm going to add a little bit of hot water in the fish I'm going to add a salt I'll add more water and I'll just leave that aside to soak for like five minutes and then I will wash it out so now guys after I have soaked our fish I am going to add my egusi in the pan and I am going to just toast this egusi uh, for like five minutes in um, low heat if you haven't tried your egusi pepper soup like this just give it a try it gives the egusi a, a kind of smoky flavor to your uh, egusi pepper soup so yes i'm going to toast that in a medium to low heat just keep turning it and yeah after toasting my egusi i am going to put it here and let it dry a bit before i blend it i am going to allow it to cool down before i blend it okay so you need it to cool down because it's still very hot so give it like five minutes or ten minutes for it to cool down and then you blend it so guys i am going to start blending all my all my ingredients i'm going to blend my crayfish i'm going to blend my ehusi i'm going to blend my um egusi i'm going to pound my pepper so basically i'll start preparing stuff that i need to prepare i don't need to show all that details but i just want to explain it to you that i'm going to be doing it also then slice all my vegetables so let's blend the crayfish first <laughs> So 
so guys this is my blended egusi but i am going to add a little bit of warm water in it because i want to mix it with water before i put it inside the pot you can totally put it the way it is dry you can put it dry or you can do this method and um, yeah i'm gonna use my hand mixer and just wix it up together with the water before i add it inside the pot so guys our meat is ready i'm going to take out all the onions from the meat so guys after taking out my onions i'm going to add my dry fish I'm going to add my egusi. I'm going to add water. I'm adding more water. I'm going to add crayfish. I'm going to add a who seed. I'm going to add my habanero pepper and I'm going to mix. I'm going to cover and put it back on the stove. Let it start boiling. So I'm going to put it back and cook it for 10 minutes. So guys, after 10 minutes, I am going to taste for Maggi and salt. I'm going to add two Maggi. There's no Maggi. And yes, guys, I can smell the toastiness of the, um, of the Egusi. It really smells so lovely. Okay, I'll test again. Yeah, okay, now there's Maggi. I don't need to add salt. I'm going to cover for another five minutes. So guys, after five more minutes, I am going to add my veg. I'm going to mix. And with this veg, I am going to just leave it for a few seconds, maybe two or three seconds. And yeah, this is ready. I'll test again for Maggi and salt. Yeah. Okay. So this is ready now. I'll just cover it, let the vegetable simmer a bit for a few seconds. So guys this soup is ready now I am going to take it out of the stove this is our pepper soup a goosey soup and it is ready guys like I said before if you are on a diet and if you don't want to add the palm or you this is a good recipe for you and this absolutely smells so lovely the ehu seed and the toastiness of the egusi like it smells so wonderful guys so yes this is it so guys this is it guys this is our soup please do not forget to give your girl a thumbs up please like and please share this is where today's recipe is going to end. I hope you enjoyed it. So guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this wonderful recipe. Thank you so much for spending a lovely, wonderful time with me here in my kitchen. I really, really appreciate you stopping by. And if you have stick around to the end of the video, you are absolutely the best thank you so much and yeah i hope you enjoy this recipe i totally enjoy making this recipe thank you so much and i will see you guys on my next one bye